from a, a spiritual perspective, what a dream, why do we dream? Why do you think the wise universal not, uh, you know, power or whatever we want to call it, the self created this mechanism for dreaming. What do you think the purpose of it is? Yeah, it's a good question. I mean, we, we know, for example, that we need to dream. And first of all, we need to sleep. <laughs> and almost every animal on the planet sleeps mm -hmm. uh, in one form or another. Uh, and so it's, it's deeply ingrained in the creation, mm -hmm. right? It's not only human beings it's like part of the whole system we need to kind of go into that inner space and we do it every night every mm -hmm. 24 hours we spend a pretty good chunk of time you know seven or eight hours sleeping and then within that then we experience this these these things called uh, dreams mm -hmm. uh, at the spiritual level we know that the shamanistic traditions, the kind of the, the spirit guides, the, the connection with medicinal plants and power plants, mm. hallucinogenic plants, came through dreams. Mm. You know, uh, from the ordinary point of view, you would think, well, people learn to use medicinal plants simply by trial and error. Mm -hmm. But that's not actually how it happens. People that have studied uh, traditional tribes, what they say is that, no, the plant came to me in a dream. Mm. And it told me, try me this way or, or prepare me this way and, and you, I will guide you in, in the, that spiritual process. So it's a, different, a very different way of seeing history. Mm. That it's not just this trial and error that we're going through. That there's a living uh, kind of a, a psyche going on beyond our personal, like individual That's human right. experience. That's so right. even uh, like Paul McCartney, he um, he that song "Let It Be." Mm -hmm. He it says Mother Mary came to me speaking words of wisdom. He had a dream about his mother, who is named Mary, and she told him to let it be <laughs> because he was struggling with the Beatles breaking yeah. up. And so songs come through dreams. Um, uh, I, I think there's a lot of artists that say they got had a dream about a painting and then they painted it. And so, I mean, this is why we call ourselves the creative mind uh -huh. <laughs> because it is this, there's, there's, it's easy to just replicate and repeat and learn basically how to function in the world. But there's this other element of the human spirit that's un unlimited that brings new ideas, that inspiration. This is how we move humanity forward. So the dream dream world can actually give us that wisdom to change the world, and and maybe it's a solution that um, to bring world peace or or in your life that that you haven't thought of before that no one else on the planet can tell you uh, you know how to do something, but then mm -hmm. the dream the it's like your inner wisdom speaking to you.